Every spring at Dick Hauser Stadium, the tarp comes off, the grass is trimmed, the seats are filled with Seminole fans, and the Florida State baseball players step onto Mike Martin Field to show the world just what they're made of. Walls on for the second time today. Walked in the first here with a single to lead things off in the first. The past two seasons, Seminole fans have counted on one shortstop to always appear on the diamond. Number 10, Taylor Walls. Taylor has proven his talent during his career as a Seminole, being one of the only players to play every single in-season game since he became a Florida State student athlete. You know, that's something that is one of my goals is to play every single game I'm able to play while I'm here at Florida State. In 2016, Taylor led the team with 72 runs scored, a total of 311 plate appearances, and over 200 assists. Walls also ended the season with an incredible 355 batting average. And while not at FSU, Walls was able to take his talents overseas last summer as a part of the 2016 USA Baseball Collegiate National Team. Just kind of see the culture of how baseball was played you know, around the world. You know, I've never really been out of the country besides from when I traveled with Team USA and just to see like how they play was unreal. But that wasn't the only accolade earned by Walls in 2016. He was also named first team All-American, All-ACC second team, and made the ACC Academic Honor Roll. It's the skills that earned him those awards that his teammates say will make a difference on the field. He's really dedicated to this sport. He's, uh, he's fun to play with. He's fun to pitch with. Uh, I know he's got my back on every ground ball to shortstop and me and him have great communication on and off the field and it's just, he's a good teammate. It's not always work when it comes to Taylor Walls. He's also known for his fun personality. You know, I feel like he's always got the best walk-ups. I know for sure. Like every time he's gonna come into the plate, he likes to change his walk-up songs and everyone in the dugout likes to get into it. And uh, I don't know what he's got this season, but it's gonna be good. It's funny. It was funny because the team kind of has like a joke where like he doesn't like everyone says like close your mouth because he's always like sm like he's always smiling and mouth is open so like everyone tell him like oh well, should be sitting there smiling and someone say like close your mouth man like why why you why's your mouth open because like he's always cheesing about something like you just never know why. Walls dedicates his baseball career to his parents. He says without their efforts, he wouldn't be where he is today. I'll think about it every now and then just all the money they put in for me to play when I was little, you know. All the time my dad used to put in for me when I'd go to the field, you know, like after school or something, if he'd have to get off work, off work early. You know, every single weekend they were not, you know, they were taking them not doing something to go with me to play baseball. So just all the time, the money, the effort, you know, just everything and just doing it for them. Since the first step on the diamond, Walls has shown that his determination is never ending earning multiple accolades along the way, this seminal is en route to greatness. With the new season rolling in, there's no doubt Taylor Walls will lead the team off to a good start on the road to Omaha. I'm Marie Aldana for Seminole Sports Magazine.